All right, Big Herc has invited the students to stay after class. Let's see what this is all about, Christy. The general manager about to lay it down, whatever it is, for the fans. So, hi. Thanks all of you for coming out tonight. Just a quick update on the rosters thing. Yes, we are getting a lot more signings, which is great. And you'll be seeing newly signed stars as the weeks go by. But that's not why I'm out here. See, our WL has a sectarian problem. It's one thing to put a little showmanship into your performance, but the sectarians are facing some pretty serious allegations. Plus, this hacking into the program signal thing is going to stop. Today, I need someone from the sect. I don't care who. Well, Christy, it looks as if Herc's gonna get himself an answer after all. Good on Steve. He needs to show them sectarians who's running this show. Well, Christy, look at this Kaz Manson. Coming out of hiding at long last. The guru of the sectarians. Finally, comes out from behind the curtain. Look at this, he's not even accustomed to the light. He's having trouble getting around. It's the antithesis of the Kaz Manson we saw at the Labor Day Slamathon wiping out the stronghold, that's for sure. Maybe he's pretending to be that way. Hey, I'm over here, Kaz. I'm gonna keep this as simple as you are, Kaz. Lilith Morella, let's start with that crap. She's not setting foot in this ring till she's cleared by the staff doctor. That's one. All I need is proof you guys kidnapped Hana, and I will nail you right to the wall. Also, if this show's signal gets messed with ever again, it's fines and suspensions time. And I'm serious about it, Kaz. Third and most important, all these other people you want signed to rage and snarl. That crap ain't happening, brother Kaz. Three extra stable mates per show. That's it. You don't intimidate me, Mr. Bohunk. Now, Steve, let me say this to you. You don't want to screw around with destiny, brother. This thing is bigger than me, bigger than you, bigger than the sect. Don't you get in the way, you might get hurt. Maybe your big redhead girlfriend might get hurt, and I don't think you'd want that. Yes, you're gonna make me hurt you, brother, and trust me, Dick. I don't need voodoo or boogie men to make it happen. Go near one of mine. Whoa, Steve. What's he doing? I believe he's telling Kaz he went too far in threatening Dion the Titanus. Whoa, whoa, look at this! Kaz Manson! Striking back against Steve Gross. Oh, well, this has just exploded. This has just gone completely out of control. Kaz Manson and Steve Groves in a brawl here. Ah, uh, I don't see no brawl, Don. I see her kicking the crap out of Kaz, and Kaz trying to fight back and messing that part all up too. Brawl, he says. Hercules is kicking the well-deserved crap out that ugly little dwarf. I don't believe he pursed his lips to threaten Dion. That little mug is crazy. Indeed, Kaz Manson has driven Herc over the edge. He has gone absolutely berserk. And Kaz Manson, desperately trying to fight back, trying to fight his way out of that situation, but it's like shooting a BB gun at a battleship. Ah, uh, check this out, Don. Herc's setting up a little project in the corner. He is indeed, and Kaz is... Oh! He just tried to split Kaz Manson in half. That is not the same Kaz from the Labor Day Slam Athon Don. He was unbeatable then, takes on three guys and wins. And now there's this Kaz, getting his ass handed to him by the goat of RWL. What's going on with that? Don't know, Christy, maybe he was only capable of doing it once. Whoa! Herc doing the hustle with Kaz Manson here. Uh-oh. Oh, this don't bode well. Christy. A disturbance by the stage area could be Papa Shango, could be the Boogeyman, could be anybody. This is not good. Herc's in trouble here. Kaz Manson from behind sneaks up on Herc. Hard punch. Hard punch to Herc. I don't believe it. Oh, Kaz Manson. Down again, Herc. Quickly back to his feet, shaking off the hard punch. Go on, Steve. Break him in half, little son of a... Thunder of Zeus. On Kaz Manson. Kaz Manson. Getting the life literally strangled out of him. 
Hart has lost it. Kaz Nesson indeed going far too far and threatening Dion the Titaness. And that just took Herc over the edge here. Kaz Manson trying to indicate that he's perfectly okay. Whips Herc into the corner. Herc right there on the scene again quickly. Reducing Kaz Manson's plans to nothing. Herc stalking the Kaz Man here. Oh, and here we go. Up and look, Kaz Manson rolls them over, but this ain't a match. You can't pin him. Kaz Manson rounds up. Her, and uh, again, a second hard punch. This can't be good. Kaz Manson resorting to desperation maneuvers here. Kaz with a kick to the leg. But hurt again. Quickly on the scene, quickly reducing Kaz's plans to nothing. And woohoo! Hurt literally strangling Kaz Manson. And Kaz is gone. He is out. He is out to lunch. And Hurt seems quite satisfied with himself. Indeed, Kaz Manson. Crossing the line, crossing the boss. Don't screw with the Eagles if you don't know how to fly, Christy. I'm glad Steve stood up to the sect, but Kaz was right this time. He started a damn war. I'm sure, Christy, this is going to lead to further complications down the road, and we're going to have to deal with those another time. We're out of time for this edition of RWL Rage, as always. We thank you fans for being with us, and we hope you'll be with us next time for our next RWL telecast, which will be RWL Ladies' Night, a special edition midweek, October 9th, Wednesday night this week. For all of us here at RWL, Don Hickson saying thanks, good night, and we will see you at ringside next time.